What's up guys, Kets here and welcome to episode 5 of The Only Way as Wagers. Today we have some awesome little games, we've got some very high rolling wagers up against Glover and up against Finch. But before we get stuck into it, what I do quickly want to say is if you want a fast and reliable coin service, check out utcointraders.com, there's a link to them in the description below. So, I have a couple little things that I want to talk about in this uh, in this episode. So as you can see, uh, this was actually recorded like the day that Benteke came out, so it was actually a really cool team at the time to have the informed Benteke and the third informed Bale, I believe it is. But um, what I mainly want to talk about today is uh, is what I'm getting up to today. So uh, some of you know, as you saw in yesterday's video, that actually at the time of this upload, and I'm not at home, uh, I'm currently recording this commentary at 9am today, so that is why I sound horrendously tired. Uh, I was up really late last night getting footage for this video and the other video coming up today and editing it and stuff like that. So uh, I'm quite tired at the moment, but um, basically it is Arsenal Wigan tonight and I'm off up into London ridiculously early. I've got, to, uh, I've got some things I'm going to keep myself busy with in the morning I'm also going to do a bit of shopping then uh, I'm hoping to meet up with my brother who's having some meetings up in London we're going to have some lunch and then uh, as mentioned in my video yesterday my granddad is actually in hospital at the moment um, I don't know if I should t oh, I'll say the details now about what's going on basically um, he uh, he's got stomach cancer um, and he has been uh, trying to get it sorted out for about a year now it's been an absolute nightmare he's had like a failed scoop uh, operation where they couldn't get any of it out and he's had loads of annoying stuff going on but uh, finally after all this time they've got it sorted out he's have it he had uh, two thirds of his stomach removed last week and he's in a hospital up in London so um, since I'm going up there and my uh, my mum and sister are also going up there so I'm going to be meeting them there but uh, I thought it'd be nice just to go and uh, visit him so I've got a really full packed day up in London today also I do want to say as well thanks for all the well wishes that my granddad got in yesterday's video it is uh, it's definitely appreciated and and I'm sure he would appreciate it, even if he doesn't know what any of this is. But uh, yeah, he is. He's on the way up and uh, he's got through the surgery and apparently was successful as well. So that is good. But anyway, um, as you can see in this wager, it is absolutely jam-packed. I've been all over Glover. Not sure if you saw there, 20 wagers to 7. And he managed to take... Uh, 20 shots to 7, rather. And he managed to take it to penalties at 4 all. Uh, it seems like I absolutely failed with it. But uh, he, uh, he had the penalties and... Well, it was, uh, I had the bail up front, I think. I played with a very odd team. It was like a 3-5-2 or 4-2-2-2 or, four, two, two, two or something. And for some reason, I was playing with Bale. Uh, and uh, he, oh, uh, you see here, he's d he saved um, one of my penalties, basically. So he scores this one, and then I step up to take a very important penalty with Hatton Ben Arthur. And he, he guesses it right, and that's the crucial moment because he then scores his penalty. I then score my one. But it's too little too late because I don't manage to save his. So that means he actually wins the wager and uh, gets the 40k, which I send over in a second. Look how close Czech Sand was to that. But... Um, so that means now we are on uh, a certain amount of games. It'll pop up in a second. But um, basically, yeah, to summarise what I was saying just now, that means I'm not going to be reading the comments today. So don't expect any direct replies or stuff straight away today. But hopefully tomorrow I'll be back. I've got, I do have an exam tomorrow, but after that I'm done for a little while. So uh, I will be able to read comments and stuff like that and get back up to date with all what is going on tomorrow afternoon uh, and all that good stuff. So I won't be around this afternoon but I will be tomorrow feel free to tweet me though and also if you are going to the Arsenal game Arsenal Wigan then uh, yeah let me know maybe tweet at me it would be cool if I could see any subscribers there or anything like that but um Next game we come up against Finch and this is for a 40k wager as well and Finch is a lot better than Glover. They're both good players but Finch is very very solid. I struggle to beat him and uh, I have a really poor mindset on wagers. See here I came so close to equalising but I have a really poor mindset that I can hold out and hold out at 0-0 and I can have all the pressure on them in the world and even at 1-0 but as soon as it goes to 2-0 or as soon as I concede a second goal even if it's like 3-2 to me or I've had it where I've been 4-0 up and it's got to like they've conceded one and I just crumble. I don't know why, just my defence just goes absolutely horrendous. I play another game which will be in an episode maybe in a couple days against a, a, a very big YouTuber and uh, it just it goes horribly wrong very, very quickly. But uh, I did pull one back here as you can see, but like at, at the 2-1 point, I was just giving up. Like I was rushing my goalie out and stuff because it frustrates me that I give up so quickly. And see here, I'm ultra attacking. He'd like easy, just goals, goals, goals for him. So... We did kind of waste this 40k as well as the 40k that we lost to Glover for the uh, the stupid oh excuse me 
Oh, a stupid penalty shootout that I was I dominated him in the game of, which is so frustrating for that to happen. But there's nothing you could do about it, and we lost to Finch 5-1. So that is actually the end of this episode, guys. In a second, you will see me going and buying the card. But uh, this game, Finch definitely deserved the win. He was all over me. But uh, thanks always for watching, guys. I hope you did enjoy this video. Let me know any other YouTubers and stuff that you want me to play for some wagers. I've already played against a bunch of them, so that should be awesome. But thanks always for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.